For parents, it's often a fine line between wanting your kids to play sports and worrying about your kids playing sports. One thing is certain, whether the players are in Pee Wee or the pros, they don't always admit when their bell is rung after a hit. Now, players will tell the coach that they may be hurt, whether they say it or not. Even for the youngest players, the hits can be hard. Combine that with the added size and strength at a professional level of sport, and the repercussions are compounded. If you want to play, you can't necessarily prevent injury. But Irish inventor Mark Dillon has come up with something he calls the Mamori Mouth Guard, which will help athletes and coaches better detect one particular injury that can be otherwise invisible, the concussion. Hi, Mark, good to see you. Yeah, thanks, Mom, I'm really glad to be here. How did you come up with the idea of a mouth guard that measures the severity of hard hits? My main inspiration for the Memorial Mouth Guard was um, a really severe head injury that Sidney Crosby had received while playing for the Pittsburgh Penguins. And he had uh, suffered from something known as second impact syndrome, which is where a player will receive a concussion and they'll be unaware that they're concussed. And the player will continue to play and they'll receive a second impact, which will almost double the effects of the first concussion. That was my main inspiration for the project. Originally, Mark created a prototype for a helmet, but when his research revealed that it's the relatively unprotected jaw which often accounts for concussions, he changed his focus to a mouth guard. What the product is designed to do is to measure impact forces received by people during contact sports such as ice hockey or American football. Basically, the gum shield will record data and any kind of large impacts that are received by a player and it will use an algorithm to determine if this force is strong enough to cause the player a concussion. Customized for each player, the mouth guard uses a combination of sensors, an accelerometer, a magnetometer, and a gyroscope. And immediately upon impact, data is transmitted wirelessly to a computer on the sidelines. You know, if you have a, a few ankle injuries, when you get older, you might have arthritis in your ankle. But if you get a few head injuries, or you get constant concussion, you can have serious illnesses when you get older. Mark remains in heavy research mode before someday making the mouth guard available worldwide. And what impact do you hope this innovation has on the world of athletics? Basically, when I started the project, the project was aimed at, you know, keeping athletes in the game and rather than miss a whole season, they're missing one or two games and also to help them to recover as well. Well, Mark, we wish you the best of luck. Thanks, Mo.